Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a shop with me at Body Care Day. So I am actually about to head over to my store. It is almost 11. I'm taking an early lunch break and it is Friday, December 9th. So I'm going on the first day and I'm really excited to get there. I honestly, you guys don't need a lot of body care, but I want to get some stuff to last me for next year. Um, I definitely want to get some sugar plum. Um, I want to get some Midnight Amber Glow backups and... Um, some wrapped in sugar. I know for sure I'm getting those. And then I have a few Christmas gifts on my list. I have a list on my app on my phone, but I'm just excited to see what they have. I hope they have some like retired scents maybe. Um, so yeah, we're just going to go and we're going to see what they have. I actually could do with a few more like body creams or shower gels. I'm good on lotions, I think for now, besides the ones that I'm going to get in like a set. Um, but yeah, that's what I'm planning on getting. And we're just gonna go and see what my store has. My store is like literally only seven minutes away, so it's pretty close. And I am excited to see what they've got. So let's head on over to the store. All right, we're about to head in. I've got my Candle Bay bag because we're all about that reusable bag gang, but um, I'm here at Bath Body Works and let's head on inside. All right, so we are heading inside, and like I said, it's around lunchtime, so it was a little busy in the store. Honestly, not too busy, though. Um, I could definitely still film tables without having a lot of people in the background, so that was great. But you walk right in, and of course, they have holiday traditions up front. They really didn't have too much bright Christmas morning left or ice sugar plum, but they had another setup of the tradition ones um, somewhere else in the store, too. So they had like two more tables of this stuff. So this was not all of it. And then if you circle around the back, they had some more. I was really looking for bath bombs, but they did not have pretty much any bath bombs left. They had a few winter candy apples at the checkout, but that was about it. Um, but I did find that Vanilla Bean Noel Shimmer Fizz Lotion. I don't remember them having it in Vanilla Bean Noel, but they have it in that and in winter candy apple. And like I said, just a few of the bath bombs, but the associates said they didn't have too many left. Um, and then this beautiful exfoliating glow body scrub is just so gorgeous life of the party is beautiful in person this is pink citrus bubbly prosecco jasmine and shimmering vanilla vanilla it's basically champagne toast but with more jasmine i think so but that packaging is absolutely to die for and then we have the new golden eclipse prismatic stars and sapphire moon they all smell good to me but honestly not stand out um, and then Winter Cherry Blossom. I actually really enjoyed this one. It's Frosted Cherry Blossom, Ruby Berries, and Silky Amber. This one smells pretty good. Um, still a little too floral for my taste, but much better than Japanese Cherry Blossom. I don't really even smell like any similarity, but this packaging again was just gorgeous and like kind of holographic. And then the huge table of Dream Bright. They had so much of this all throughout the store. They had all the different variations that, you know, Diamond Shimmer Mist, they had a few more of those body butters. They had the bubble bath, which is 1850, so that's a great deal for this sale. And then this collection, um, I really don't think this is that popular, but um, Winterberry Wonder, Snowflakes and Cashmere, I love this shimmering body lotion, but this looks a lot smaller, like you don't get a lot of product in there. And then Strawberry Snowflakes and Frosted Coconut Snowball. And then Fire, Fireside Flurries is back again this year. So yeah, that's that collection. I didn't see a lot of people picking that up though. And I also didn't see like anyone picking up this beautiful collection. I love this sweater collection. It's so gorgeous. So we have Blush Cardigan. Also the packaging on here is like elite. It's so gorgeous. Uh, raspberries. I didn't read all of that. That was too fast. <laughs> Cozy Evening is back. This one's really nice and like fresh, but a little too lavendery for me. And then Wrapped in Vanilla is definitely my favorite in this collection. It is a beautiful vanilla with like cake almost to it. And then the men's section was popping off, you guys. They have so many men's scents nowadays. Like, it's kind of crazy. I love this new packaging that they have for the men's collection. I think this is so upscale. Like, you find this in like Nordstrom looking at the men's care collections. Um, but let me know if any of your men that you know wear lotion because the ones that I know sure don't <laughs> but they had so many different ones the you know bourbon coffee or what was it leather and brandy coffee and bourbon 
coffee and whiskey sorry and then this new birch and um eucalyptus scent which i was looking for the scent notes but i don't think they actually have scent notes on these it's just like a little sentence but this one smelled good it definitely smelled just like fresh eucalyptus um and there it is right there if you wanted to pause and read that one they had the whiskey reserve over here the packaging on all of this is so gorgeous crisp apple malt whiskey and white oak really loved this scent and then this one smoked old-fashioned i thought this was so fun of them to do some cocktail collections for the men because as you know you know women we always have those collections but they don't get to have like as much fun stuff so i really like that they've started doing that for the men's collections now um and they had so much aromatherapy like every scent possible the um lavender and vanilla ones i thought this was a great deal for the bath soaks bath salts scrubs all of this was such a great deal and they had so much of it and then coming back over here they had a lot of butterfly leftover and a lot of these like signature collections so tons of gingham some gingham love still left over they even had scrubs of that one you're the one um dream bright in the stars and into the night and a thousand wishes of course they even had some fallen bloom left over tons of poppy which i know that was super popular if you guys are still looking for poppy i doubt it'll be cheaper at sas all right y'all that was intense i got a lot of stuff so the haul is going to be coming after this video but i will spoil it and say that i got the blanket but my associates were so sweet they were helping me the whole time i was probably in there let's see how long 46 minutes i got in there at 11 it's 11 45 so that was amazing great body care day did so many amazing finds so i'm gonna show you guys what i got when i got home when i get home but amazing body care day if you haven't already gone out you need to go so that's everything for this video i hope you guys enjoyed if you did like comment and subscribe down below turn on that post bell notification so you can be notified when i post the haul and i will see you guys in the next video bye